Hi there, this is about setting up a local domain name um, which points to your local host so you develop your site on your machine as you would want to. Um, I'm a web designer, this is aimed at web designers, but I'm personally I'm not a fan of terminal in, the, <laughs> in, a, in any way, shape or form, but um, it's necessary to use terminal for this job. Luckily it's not very hard, so let's, let's get on with it. So open up Terminal, so you go to Finder, um, you go to Utilities, and Terminal's in there. Uh, when you open it up you, you get this screen, and what you want to do is type in sudo, so sudo, um, which gives you global control, I believe. Um, Vim, which again I'm not an expert, but I, I think it's a text editor that runs within Terminal. Don't quote me on that. And and then the path to your um, the file that you need to update, which is um, etc slash hosts. With terminal, you can't use a mouse, so I can't click anywhere. Doesn't make any difference. You have to use um, keys. Um, that that file um, in etc. slash host is a hidden file, so you'll struggle to find it in Finder anyway. So hit enter. It'll ask you for your password. It won't show up when you type it, but it does work. So you can see I'm navigating around with my cursors. Um, this here, I believe, is the um, IP address for your local host. I might be wrong, but anyway. So you can see I've got a few websites set up um, locally on this machine. So um, I need to edit this file which means I need to type in um, I and to hit I which brings up insert here uh, I don't mean to knock that onto there we go um, and what you need to do is type in your um, IP whatever it is and then the domain, the local domain name that you want for your local site. So I always, you, you can pretty much use whatever you want, but I like to have local dot whatever the site is. So whatever dot com. Um, if you're happy with that, then you will want to save it but first you have to press escape to exit the insert mode um, if you want to quit without saving you type in colon q exclamation mark as you can see it comes up down the bottom here but we want to save it so we'll type in um, colon wq hit enter and that's saved and, that, and that's all you have to do um, then from this is all assuming that you've installed MAMP already um, then from within MAMP you can go to preferences and this is then selecting the site that you're kind of directing um, MAMP's attention onto so in that we would I, I, I like to have all my sites within Google Drive because you know, cloud storage and all. Um, oops. Oops. <laughs> um, so just, you know, as you would expect, just um, select the site that you, um, you know, you've made the folder for. Hit OK. And then start your servers and, and off you go.